Besides being effective for diagnosing lung cancer at early stages, low-dose CT has several benefits. The scan is non-invasive and painless. During a low-dose CT, the patient lies still on a table, and the scanner rotates around the patient as the table passes through the center of the scanner. The scan lasts 7 to 15 seconds and is performed during a single breath hold. This is an important benefit for patients with difficulty holding their breath. In addition, CT lung screening is covered by insurance for eligible individuals. Low-dose CT screening has some risks and limitations. There is a possibility of a false positive result. The average false positive rate per screening found in the NLST was 23.3%, but in a retrospective analysis of NLST using current clinical practice of structured reporting with lung rads to be discussed later in this module, the false positive rate was 7.8%. Additional CT scans and biopsy or surgery may be needed to confirm a diagnosis of lung cancer. When lung cancer is not diagnosed, there may be complications from invasive diagnostic procedures. There may be overdiagnosis or detection of indolent lung cancer that would not have become life-threatening, but this is very rare. Finally, as with many screening procedures, patients are exposed to some radiation, although it's about one-fourth of that in a standard CT. Lifetime exposure from repeat annual testing should be considered.